here we introduce this sand and dust test chamber. Open the chamber safety door and the inside is the test area. The dust needs to be screened into the test area with a screen before the test starts. Then we place the sample into the test area. If the sample needs to be powered, there is a socket on the test area to supply power to the sample. First disassemble the blue and white plug. Put the sample power wire through the round hole on the back of the white part of the plug. Insert the red and blue wires into the corresponding holes and lock them with screws. Close the blue and white part of the plug and lock them with screws. Plug it into socket. There is also a device next to the power socket that provides a vacuum to the device. If the test requires vacuuming, first drill a hole somewhere on the surface of the sample. Then align the vacuum suction cup with the hole we drilled. If it is not easy to fix, please use tape to fix it, and make sure it will not fall off. Close the safety door after placing the sample. Next, enter the parameter screen. Set the corresponding standard parameters to start the test. If heating and vacuum are required, there are corresponding temperature and pressure gauges next to the chamber. When the test time reaches the set time, it will enter the alarm mode. After completion, we take out the sample. There are some switch buttons on the side of the sand and dust test chamber. The top is the main switch. Next is emergency button. Next is the vacuum gauge to adjust the vacuum value in the test area. Next is the thermometer to adjust the temperature in the test area. Here we introduce the operation method of the replacement flowmeter. Replace 0.2 to 2 liters per minute flowmeter with 2 to 20 liters per minute flowmeter. Pull out the air pipe. Press the blue nozzle when pulling out the air pipe. Loosen the two screws on the back of the small flowmeter. Remove the two nuts of the large flowmeter. Align and put into large flowmeter. Lock the nut on the back of the large flowmeter. After the test, if it is not used for a long time, there is an opening under the funnel to remove the dust in the chamber from here. That's all for the video. Thanks for watching.